Well, the NDP has a new leader, Jagmeet Singh, but he is without a seat in the House of Commons. And joining us now is Catherine McIntyre with McLean's on the pros and cons of what this means for Jagmeet Singh. What are the benefits to him not having a seat at this point? The benefit of that is that he is freed up from having to be in Ottawa, from having to be in Parliament every day. Um, and the, the pros of that, I suppose, are that he has time to be out in the community, um, growing his base, fundraising for the next federal election, and uh, really recruiting solid candidates for, uh, for the NDP. Which is his strength. He's a, a people politician, I would say, and, and he has, you know, sort of the charisma of a Justin Trudeau. Do you think that will work in his favor? That certainly is the thinking, or was originally. Um, a lot of political strategists have said that, um, you know, Jagmeet Singh has no problem attracting media attention and um, attention from from Canadians. So he's out there in the public, in communities. Um, people will will pay attention to him, and he'll really be able to connect with uh, potential. Uh, constituents and like Trudeau he's very social media savvy this is right yeah he he is there on social media um, I mean there have been some criticism recently about uh, whether or not he's uh, you know really seeking the the media spotlight the traditional media spotlight and whether he's thriving in that spotlight um, at this point but certainly he has the opportunity to do that with the time that he has not in Parliament. So what is the downside to him not having a seat in the House of Commons? Parliament is the centre of Canada's democracy, technically speaking, and it is where you bylaws or where laws and policies are debated, where they're decided on. It's where the opposition parties question the Prime Minister on a daily basis, where they hold the government to account. Um, and if he's not there, then he isn't showing Canadians that that he's able to, uh, you know, to tangle with, with the government and, uh, and hold that government to account. When do you think, realistically, he will try and get a seat in the House of Commons? Jagmeet Singh has made it fairly clear that he doesn't intend on uh, trying for a seat until the next general election in 2019. Um, if there was a seat to come up in, you know, his home community, Brampton, Ontario, then um, a lot of people are saying he'd be wise to go for it. Um, he, I would assume that he would probably go for it as well because his chances of winning would be so high. It's unlikely there'll be a by-election there. So, um, yeah, it, it looks like it'll be 2019. Interesting. All right. Well, thank you very much for joining us, and it will be interesting to watch how he uh, plays on the federal stage in the years to come. And you can read Catherine McIntyre's full article on mcleans.ca.